channel. I am the Anne and I am a new YouTuber. Today I will be talking about my September beauty favorites. And I know it is kind of early September, it's not even over yet, but I wanted to get this up as soon as possible. So today I will be talking about a few of my beauty favorites and I have two products that are not beauty related and yeah. Please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel if you would like to see more videos. Also, you can leave comments down below if you tell me what you would like to see on my channel as comments are always welcome. So, yeah. Oh, without really, oh also all my information will be listed in the down box if you want to find me on Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, all of that will be listed down below. So without any further ado, let's get into the video. The first thing I'm going to be talking about today is the palette that I used on my eyes. This is the Be Beautiful Cosmetics palette. So it comes with a mirror and then it comes with two blushes. I don't know why they said this was a blush. Yeah. They said that these two are blushes, but I use this one under my brow bone highlighting and then I use these shadows. I just think these are really good smoky eye shadows and I wouldn't use this as a blush either. I would rather use it as a shadow, as a, a very light shimmery pink shadow. So if you're looking for a nice affordable um, uh, eyeshadow palette then I would definitely recommend this, this one. Um, as I said, I will have all the information listed below in the down bar, but I must warn you that I could not find the specific brand that this was from, so I will keep looking for you guys and then I will let you know. Um, the next thing I would like to talk about is, I'm just going to stick to all my beauty favorites first, the Yardley London well, 16 hour airbrush foundation. This is for a refined Flawless finish, weightless cover, and it's also light diffusing as well as having SPF 25. The reason I like, oh, and also this is in the color natural. I am wearing it on my face at the moment. I wasn't sure about the color at first. So, yes, um, two things I want to say about this. One is that it's not very heavy on your face. It doesn't feel, ugh, I hate wearing very heavy makeup um, when I just want to, you know, throw on some makeup. And also another thing about this is that I would also recommend applying this with a damp beauty blender or your fingers instead of with a brush. I just feel that when you do when you use this with a brush it doesn't spread out evenly and I got my foundation like this due to the fact that I use a damp beauty blender, which I will be showing you. So this is the beauty blender I use. I know it looks very uh, I didn't know I didn't have time to wash it. Um, as I just wanted to throw it into the focus video, but these will be getting a bit late tonight, don't worry. Um, this beauty blender is from um, Big Apple Cosmetics and it wasn't very expensive. Also another thing about this is this must be used damp. Like I used to see people use this in videos and just like applying it, not even saying that it was damp and then the first time I ever used one I was like, oh girl, this hurts my face. I was like, no, no fam, not worth it. And then only someone told me, no, you're supposed to use a damp. And when you do use a damp and you're busy with your foundation, it just, it gives you such a nice finish because it blends out your foundation very well. It uh, doesn't leave like... Um, dark spots in some areas. So this is a very good beauty blender. Also, it's not very expensive. So if you're looking for an inexpensive beauty blender, then go get this one. It's from Big Apple Cosmetics. The next thing I want to talk about is the Clinique. What color is this? Oh, <laughs> this is in the color Precious Posy. It is a blush powder. <laughs> So this is what the color looks like basically and I just feel that this is a very natural blush color. I don't know, for my face it looks very natural. I've got a lot of compliments about it saying that oh it looks very natural. It doesn't look like you, you know, went ham on that blushes. And it is from Clinique like I said and 
yeah i just feel like this color is really good if you're looking for a I'm not sure the price of this one this was gifted to me many of the things in this favorites video were gifted to me because my birthday was about a month ago so yeah <laughs> let me talk about the Isabella Garcia range um oh by the way none of these products in the video are sponsored um I just feel that like I should get it out the way because there might be like more than one product from a specific range and it's not sponsored in any way um we started the Isabella Garcia eye makeup remover. I think this color on the packaging is just too bomb. This is the eye makeup remover. I just want to take it out of the box for you. Uh, okay, so the first thing that you need to know about this is that it's fragrance and alcohol free. And this is really important because a lot of people feel like eye makeup removers can be a bit harsh around the eyes, leave it red not the case for this and um, it really gets it my mascara when my mascara gets really crappy and i feel like oh i can't wear this then i usually use this and it just really takes it away without all the effort of having to like not scrub but push really hard with a makeup remover and this is bay ah! i have to record this again because no <laughs> I had to record this again because it was an angry bird driving past. Did I just say angry bird? I mean, I mean the bike. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Um. Okay. Like I said, this is the three in one. Oh my word. The three in one nourishing night cream from Isabella Garcia, as well as um the Super Defense Day moisturizer. Both of these are moisturizers. They leave my skin feeling so soft and. I feel like they last very long. For me, most moisturizers just don't do it. Uh, they, they, I don't know, they don't last very long in my opinion. They always dry my skin out. I do have very dry skin. So, oh, and these are for all skin types or dry or dehydrated skin types. The Defense Day moisturizer is for dry or dehydrated skin types. And the the nourishing night cream is for all skin types. Okay, the next thing I'd like to talk about is the new foundation brush. My first foundation brush is from Kayla Cosmetics or Kala, I'm not sure how you pronounce it. This is what the brush looks like, flat obviously, like a foundation brush. And this is the foundation brush in the number 303. And I like this because the bristles are very dense and compact. It doesn't like spread out on your face. And it's really, it's not harsh on the skin. I feel like it really does do a good job when doing foundation. So if you are looking for a good yet inexpensive um, makeup brush, definitely try out the, I'm just going to say Kayla Cosmetics range because these are really good. And I will definitely be using this brush more often okay the last two things i want to talk about as i said are not sponsored um they are both from the oh so evenly range which can be found at most um not drug stores but oh yeah I can, i'll just link it in the down bar uh <laughs> the first one is the oh so evenly positively pink it says positively pink and then it says pretty in pink. Positively pink, pretty in pink, softening body lotion. And I just feel that this squeeze like a bunch out of my Please ignore that. Oh my gosh. So, this really does smell amazing. And also, I'm not too sure, so please don't take my word for it. But I think that some of the proceeds for if you buy these range of products go towards women with breast cancer as it is breast cancer awareness month soon and the last thing that i want to talk about is the oh so evenly luxury living five in one moment of calm room spray and um, this basically what it does is a calming fragrance it is also mood enhancing i just feel that this 
Ugh, just smelling this makes me like want to go to sleep right now. This really does help. I am a person who struggles to sleep at night. Um, you know what I'm saying? Um, I'm someone who struggles to sleep at night. I feel that I do struggle to sleep at night and due to that I needed something that would help me sleep and just a few um, spritz, sprays, a few spritz. A few, yeah, of those. Ideal Polo will knock you out like that, girl. Oh, an ideal. Mm. That was everything for my uh, September favorites. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like I said, please like, feel free to leave me any suggestions about videos that you would like to see. And yes, so thumbs up this video, like, subscribe all that jazz and like i said the rest of my information will be listed in the down bar or um so yeah that was it bye guys